Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Savannah if you are new here and today we are continuing our legacy challenge. To be honest, I'm not that excited to film this video today because we have to age Charlie up into an elder and I'm really not looking forward to it. I don't want this generation to end. It's been so much fun and I'm just so attached. I'm sure you guys know how it is, but you gotta do what you gotta do. Things eventually come to an end, but we have a lot to do in this episode. We are going to be aging up Charlie. Stella is going to be having more babies. Holy cannoli, I can't even believe it. We've got Harvest Fest. We've got um, the talent showcase. So hopefully Charlie can, we can go and Charlie can give his, um, his comedy routine just so he has like an activity to do as an elder. Cause I know that elders are kind of overlooked in The Sims 4, so. Yeah, that can be his little activity. I don't have a Celsius today. I have a giant iced coffee because it is a little bit early. Um, hold on. It's a little bit early because today is Super Bowl Sunday and um, the game starts at three. So I wanted to film before. I don't really watch football, but I like to watch the Super Bowl with my family, so, and eat good food. I'm planning on eating my body weight and nachos today. So cheers to that. Cheers to this video. Cheers to you guys. I hope you're doing amazing. <laughs> Let's get into it. Okay, you guys, here we are back in the legacy household. Oh my gosh, what is it with the lights? Is it because, oh, oh, I swear every time we come to the save file, I'm just like, what is with the lights? What is with the Aurora Borealis or whatever it's called? But it's because we're on a green lot. I get it now, I get it. <laughs> All right, let's give you guys a little refresher about what we got going on here. It looks like Caleb is here to visit, which is very exciting. Um, it looks like everyone's sleeping, which is very rare. It's Halloween today, but it's almost over. So we've got Charlie. Actually, let's have a look at the calendar. So tomorrow is Bruce's birthday. So we're going to be ab able to see what Bruce looks like as a teen in this episode, which I'm very excited about. Then the day after that, we have Harvest Fest, which we will celebrate, invite all the family over. We've got Night on the Town on the next day, and it's also Charlie's birthday. So perhaps, maybe we can round up all the adults and go out. Maybe go out to dinner or something like that. I don't know. I don't, I don't know if I'm being too ambitious in this episode, <laughs> but I'm going to try and pack in as much as possible. And then the day after that, we have the talent showcase, and it's also Leslie's birthday. So we'll be able to see Leslie's teen form very soon. If you guys forgot, we gave Stella the gardener career. It was actually Felix's wife that offered her the gardener career, and I believe she started a couple levels ahead, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, so she's level four, so I do want to try and um, max this career for her in her life. We've only maxed one career and that was with Olive. <laughs> Jobs are very, is not my focus in this Let's Play, not at all. Um, And then for Ren, oh right, I gave Ren a job too. She's an actress at level six, which is honestly insane. Um, And the skill that we are working on for her is piano. That's right, she's almost level six. Fantastic, love to see it. I think, uh, yeah, we got a lot done in the last episode, so. Yeah, everything seems to be running smoothly. Stella and Charlie are sleeping together in their beds. I feel like we never see this. Like, this never happens. But uh, it looks like Charlie is smiling in his sleep, so... He's a happy boy. He's just... I don't know. I just love him. Um, I'm just growing way more attached to him than before for some reason. I don't know. I just love him as a sim. But, yeah. <laughs> So Leslie, looks like Leslie and Ren are the only ones that are awake. Leslie's having herself a cute little bath. Ren is... Oh, it looks like she's off to sleep. She's going to nap. Okay, well, Leslie, let's focus on you a little bit. Uh, you have your homework done. You have your skill to level four. What were we trying to max for you? Mental, that's right, that's right. I wanted you and Bruce to max your mental skill. Uh, oh, right, and I also want Bruce to max his social skill before we age him up. So, why don't you, since Caleb is here, why don't you come out here and practice your social with him? Just give him a friendly introduction. And, oh yeah, we have the club gathering going as well. We're gathering some points. Currently, we have... What do we got? We have a fitness boost. We have a homework boost, a mental boost for the kids. Excuse me, a parenting boost. Ooh, shoot, I really want the social boost. I think we'll be able to get it in a minute, so that should uh, help help Bruce max his social. Um, 
yeah so that's 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 a little recap you guys um hi caleb i don't think we've ever met my name is bruce Sewell. Uh, let's quote. Oh, shoot. Hold on. No. Quote cartoon character. Dang it. Okay, just talk about school then. Talk about school. Oh, um, uh, there was a comment on the last video. One of you, a lot of you guys actually want me to have a transgender sim in this series, and I am so down for that. But, um, I do need to do, like, more research because I want to do it right. I, I know a good amount, but I just want to make sure that I'm, like, fully educated before I, like, dive into something like that. Um, because I don't want to do it wrong. I don't want to, like, um, ooh, level 9 already. Good boy. I don't want to do it wrong. I don't want to offend anyone. So, uh, just give me a little bit and I will, I'll definitely do that for you guys. No problem at all. I've been wanting to for a while. I just, like I said, I just need to, um, just become a little bit more educated. I hope you understand. <laughs> um, let's see. Talk about favorite animal. I just... Do we have 200 points yet? <gasps> yeah, we have 300 points. That was so fast. Okay, let's get that social boost um, for kids. It's this one here. Uh, I wonder if these boosts even really do anything. I, I really hope they do. Pop culture reference. Holy cannoli! Oh my gosh. Okay, wow. He literally just leveled up and he's already 65% complete through level 9. Okay, yeah, it, uh, it definitely does a lot. Caleb is just avoiding us at this point, which is fine. He probably just doesn't really want to talk to a kid. So why don't you come over here and research idioms instead of chatting? Research idioms. I don't, I'm gonna be honest, I don't even know what an idiom is. I know for a fact that I learned it in school, but I forgot already, so... Yeah! Do any of you guys just like learn things in school or take a class and then once the class is over your brain is just like nope and then it just wipes it clean of everything that you learned because <laughs> that's me <laughs> i can't ever retain anything looks like caleb's enjoying the pool that's fine you do you and we've got some distressing concoctions what's charlie doing cook chapino okay sure what were we trying to max for you oh yeah fitness 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 okay uh, let's get you out here then and get you to dream big a little bit. I am very focused on skills right now. Um, at some point in one, one of the future generations, we need to focus on the uh, collections. I have not forgot. I just am focusing on different things right now because like, I can only focus on one thing at once, I swear. Um, I just get too overwhelmed. So yeah, he's almost maxed it. Holy cannoli. I don't have my iPad, or I do, it's just over there, so I'm just gonna write it on a post-it note for now. Charlie maxed fitness, which is crazy, because he's a lazy sim. I wish there was like a, a special achievement that if you max fitness skill on a lazy sim, you get like something special. <laughs> Congratulations, Charles. You maxed your fitness skill right before you aged up into an elder love that for you honestly <laughs> what's the next thing we should max parenting yes parenting parenting for sure i think you and stella will definitely max your parenting skill before you die with all these kids you have around so why don't you um come over here and do some parenting with bruce this looks like stella's awake so let's have a look at her too um let's just teach him to say please and thank you what's stella off to do she's having a bath She's using her bathroom! Oh my gosh, I love it. I love it! They never use this bathroom. <laughs> oh man, that coffee is so good. If you guys have never tried Phil's coffee, go online right now, order some. It's so good. So, so good. Okay, so I'm pretty sure... Oh my god, I forgot she was pregnant for a second. Uh, how, do, how could I forget that? <laughs> we were maxing her wellness skill and she got it. She got it. She got it. So her and Charlie are both a level eight parenting. I don't know what else we should max for her. I guess gardening, right? She should take over the, the garden. I don't think she could super sell at the moment, but she can like maintain it and all that good stuff. It looks like everything is pretty well maintained already. You know what you could do though? Why don't you just come over here and talk to plant? I don't know. Just work on that gardening skill a little bit. Aw, Yibs! Okay, he's about to max his social skill. Keep going. Talk about your dreams. Uh, are you still teaching him? Okay, yeah, he is. Alright. Oh, no! 
Oh my gosh, no! Oh god, you guys. Deaths hit me so freaking hard in this Let's Play. Dorian passed away. Oh god, I feel absolutely just... Horrible. Poor baby! Poor, poor baby. Okay, let me show you guys the family tree because a lot of you guys have been asking to see it. So, oh my gosh, look at all the dead sims up here. So we had, I started this legacy with myself. I married Carlos and then we have, we have two kids. That's weird. Why is Ren not showing up on the family tree? Oh, because we're in Charlie's gene genealogy. Okay, let's go to Savannah. Okay, so we had Max and Ren and then... Um, Max had Max Jr., Olive, and Oliver. Ren has Kieran and Alice. Max Jr. was a accident. He, he cheated on his wife and she accidentally got pregnant. So, and then, and it, it resulted in Max. And then with his wife or with his girlfriend, Zara, they never got married. They had Olive and Oliver. And then um, Oliver married Zach and they adopted Kyla. And Kyla now has a daughter with her husband, Andy, and her name is May. Olive has Charlie. Charlie married Stella and that's where we are now. We have all of these babies. Leslie, Bruce, Zoe, <clears throat> Felix, and Luna. Max never had any kids, unfortunately, but Max was not the only one who cheated, if you guys remember. Um, so Zara had a kid with Alexander Goth, who was Max's best friend at the time. So it was, it was this big thing. <laughs> a lot of people were mad that I kicked out Zara and I didn't kick out Max, but it's like, <clears throat> I made Max do what he did for some spice and for the storyline. Zara autonomously on her own, slept with Alexander, Max's best friend, and she got pregnant from it. So that was just, I don't know, it was just different. And, and Max was the heir of the generation, so I couldn't move him out. So that's why I moved out Zara and not Max. You guys were saying that I was like treating her differently even though they did the same thing. Um, like a lot of the comments say that and that just like, I don't know, that's not, that wasn't even the case. But so yeah, Alexander and Zara, had Dorian and that's who just passed. Honestly, like that was such a long time ago and I'm just surprised that he was even still alive because Oliver, he was like the same age, around the same age as Olive and Oliver. And he just recently died, which is kind of crazy. But it doesn't look like Felix and Kay have had kids yet, which is kind of infuriating. But let me go to manage worlds and make sure that they're not like in my played households. Because if they are in my plate household, I don't think they'll get pregnant on their own. Okay, they're not. They are in my other households. So, <clears throat> I don't know why they're not having kids, guys. I don't know. Maybe it's too early. I'm not sure. But I desperately want them to have kids because it's for Charlie's aspiration. I think he wants to have like three grandkids or something like that. I don't know. I had to double check. But yeah, Felix needs to get to work. <laughs> I feel so bad. Charlie is just absolutely just feeling it. I think he was really the only one that knew him, like, on that level. Did him and Dorian, like, grow up together? I can't remember. I can't remember, but I know that I know that they, like, they just were around each other all the time. Yeah, see? They were- they had a really high relationship. They were good friends. There you go, Bruce! Level 10 social! I'm so proud. I'm glad we have Bruce, because when we lo lose Charlie, I have a feeling Bruce is gonna, like, <laughs> be there for us to uh make us feel like charlie's still around maybe oh ren's helping leslie with her homework how cute that's really adorable practice romantic scenes i think she might have to uh, like invite a co-worker over to do that so we can um, go ahead and do that too it looks like men leslie got level a of her mental skill very good very good so tonight we're gonna Yes, Charlie, level nine parenting. Love to see it. So someone needs to cook Bruce a cake. I think I'm gonna get Charlie to do it. So he's not doing anything else. <laughs> uh, what kind of cake does Bruce want, do y'all think? Hamburger cake, probably? Chocolate cake? 
um matcha tea cake we've had that for the past two birthdays so i always say this but i wish we could put um candles on pies let's do a blue confetti cake why not all right come on charlie let's go cook let's go make a cake mm, bruce is in the way okay um i think she should shoot did i click go to work i think i did <laughs> all right let's try this again Brucey, Brucey, Bruce, Bruce, enjoy those breadsticks. Do you have any friends, by the way? You probably don't. Just Leslie, which is really cute. So, Bruce, what kind of cake do you want? What kind of frosting? Hmm? So I'll take a blue confetti cake, please. Please. Oh, shoot, we need to take pics. Right, crap, I keep forgetting. Wait, didn't we take some? I don't think we did, but, um... Charlie, where's the cake? Oh, it's in the oven. Okay, fine. Sorry. I got ahead of myself there. <laughs> Stella, you're looking pregnant and beautiful. I love you. Enjoy that water. Bing bang. Hi. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Add birthday candles. Stella's off to work. Bruce is going to school in an hour. Okay. Okay. Everything seems to be fine. Let's drink this water that Stella left. And look at her eating her, her bread. I'm gonna go ahead and decorate a little bit for Bruce for when he comes home. Oh, look at this. Why don't I ever use this? <laughs> it's actually really cute. Oh my gosh, we can put this up and like put up the, the camera with the tripod and take like pictures. Okay, we can just do it outside put that there and then I think we have the camera it's in someone's inventory I'll find it okay cool all right Charlie well why don't you come out here and put this away um I definitely want to spend a lot of time with Charlie just because we're not gonna have that much time left with him but he's just chatting with Leslie so I'll let him keep going she's such a daddy's girl for sure like their relationship is very cute all right, everyone is off. Um, oh crap, I totally forgot to uh, see what Zoe's up to. When do you have school next? Three hours and you've done your homework. Good, good. Okay, what do we need to do homework for? Homework complete, homework not started, class in two days, class... Okay, so she needs to do robots of land. Okay. All right. Oh yeah, I forgot Bruce and Leslie did their projects together. So they had that. Ooh, we got a rebate. A rebate check of $21. $21? What? What happened to like our 50 grand? Or was that not the same thing? Zoe uh, ages up into an adult in seven days. And I think that we're going to give her... I think you're going to give her the potion of youth when she's an adult. I think. I don't know. You guys are going to have to let me know in the comments. Should we give her a potion of youth as a young adult or as an, an adult? I think the adult lifespan is longer. So I don't know. I don't know. I want your guys' opinions for sure. Okay, Zoe is off to class. Um, she's very late. Gravity of general relativity. Okay, uh, take notes. Shoot, I forgot to make the kids listen to the teacher. Dang it! Da da da! Dang it! And I forgot to make Stella work hard. Looks like she's feeling sad from Dorian. Poor baby. Felix is wondering if I want to go over to his house and hang out. Um, yeah, actually, let's go ahead and do that since everyone else is busy at work or at school. I do want to see what's good. I want to see if we can convince him to have a baby. I don't know if that's possible, but I'm going to try. <laughs> okay, we are here. <laughs> the lot traits. Oh my gosh. Hello, my boy. Talk about overcoming securities. Hug lovingly. Just, you know, vibe with him. Let's take a photo with him. Do we have a camera in our inventory we do okay take photo with felix arva vinya Quar. so how's the married life it's good dad it's good it's good um yeah happy to see you though very happy to see you i love living here in strangerville it's beautiful as you can see oh he's probably giving felix the news about stella being pregnant you're gonna be a brother again let's take a picture for the scrapbook eh Aww. <sighs> Look at these cuties. Why do I feel emotional, you guys? Someone freaking come collect me because I just, I cannot handle it. Is Kay here? Uh, she's around here somewhere. Oh, hey, Kay. What you doing? I'm watching the archaeology channel. 
<laughs> you don't even know each other? Oh my gosh. Okay, well, let's just give her a friendly introduction then. Just get to know her a bit. I wish, I wish, I wish, I wish we could convince her to, like, have babies. I do enjoy this house. Uh, looks like Felix is over here painting, which is cute. Let's just talk to him about Strangerville a bit, because that is his aspiration. <gasps> Stella got promoted oh my gosh okay do you have an interest in the science side of plants then use your knowledge to improve on nature botanists will analyze plants write papers and can eventually earn grants you'll also be eaten by or work with a lot of cow plants hmm. or floral designer floral designers will grow and use their plants as artistic medium the main creative outlet will be using the flower arranging table to create masterpieces but you'll start by trimming stems and leaves Oh my gosh, I don't know. I've never done the floral designer career, so I'm kind of like tempted. What are Stella's traits again? Loves outdoors, clumsy, and I think she has the creative trait, so maybe we should do the floral designer. I think that would be pretty cute for Stella, don't you guys think? She can make flower arrangements and then maybe she can clone them with her magic. I think we should go with that. I think we should go with floral designer. <laughs> Oh my gosh, how exciting. Ken K21, thank you so much for that follow on the gallery. Appreciate you. Oh my gosh, I'm so proud of Stella. So let's um let's build her shoot. Um 10 garden. Let's just do that. Oh my gosh, we got a lifestyle for Ren. Or wait. Wait, wait, wait. Was it just unlocked? The local library is known to have scientists. Okay, fantastic, fantastic, Felix. Looks like Zoe got the people person lifestyle as well. And Leslie's an A student. Top of, oh my gosh, our, we're killing it. We are just killing the game. I don't understand why you cannot take a picture. Please tell me why. Tell me why ain't nothing but a hot egg. Tell me why ain't nothing but a miss. This is so awkward, but I love it. Sorry guys, I can't sing. I don't know why I'm putting you through this, but I do want Charlie to max his photo skill. Um, I think Felix would like that because Felix maxed his. What are we at? Level three. Not bad, but also not good. Okay, no, no cooking. Let's just go home, Charlie. We've got things to do today. We can invite Felix over for Bruce's party. But yeah, he's feeling really down from Dorian's death. Poor guy. I'm excited. We need to get Stella a flower arranging table now. Okay, back home, back home, back home. All right, let me just... What is that? What is the sparkles? Looks like Zoe's grilling some pinchos. Not really sure what that is, but she's, she's doing it. <laughs> What's Bruce doing? Spin around awkwardly and then he's going on the thing. Okay, cute. So it doesn't look like we're going to be able to max any other skills at the moment. So I think that we can just go ahead and age him up. And give him his cast makeover. I'm so very excited. So many last exceptions. What? Why is household not... Why is the gathering not going? Okay, go here together. Um, do we have any other clubs? Oh yeah, family. Okay, let's start a gathering for this as well. I'm so, so, so excited. Oh, look at Stella. She's so pregnant in her, her work outfits. Oh my gosh, I die. I die, I die, I die, I die. Go here together. Brucey Bruce. No sleeps. Why don't you just go to the bathroom and then get your booty back here so you can blow out the candles. Okay, come on, Brucey. Come on, Brucey Bruce. Happy birthday, sir. Oh, my heart, my soul is so cute. Oh my gosh, I don't know why I'm nervous. I am just nervous. Okay, so Charlie is cheerful. He is lazy and he is also a geek. Stella is clumsy. She is creative and she also loves the outdoors. And his child trait was goofball. Okay. Oh my gosh, we are about to figure out his teen his adult aspiration <gasps> 
fingers crossed it's like the the Mount Komarebi one because I thought that maybe snowboarding could be his thing. I'm nervous. I either want the Mount Komarebi one or the Beach Life one. I think either of those would work, but you know what? This challenge is so unpredictable and it always steers me in a very different direction than what I have in my head. So let's go ahead and see. I'm so scared. I'm nervous. Oh my gosh. <laughs> he got the lazy tray and he wants to be an actor. What? That is the complete opposite of what I had in mind, but it is what it is. You gotta do what you gotta do, I guess. So, where's the lazy treat? I did not want this for him. I wanted him to be active. I wanted him to be into sports. Master actor. Okay. Oh my gosh, look at him. <gasps> All right. All right, it looks like he got Charlie's body type from what I can see, but let's head into, let's head into Cass and see what we can do for him. Why Sims God? Why? <laughs> I actually really like that aspiration, just not for him, you know, but whatever. It is what it is. I'm going to stop moaning about it now. Oh my gosh, you guys, look at this boy. He is like the perfect combination of Stella and Charlie. He got a hamburger head, which I'm okay with. So let's see here. Mr. Sir had heter heterochromia. Um, oh my gosh. He looks just like Felix, just a little bit different. That nose, his jaw, his chin, I mean, Everything is beautiful. I like the V-skin. I think the V-skin is going strong in this family. I think I'm going to give him the down-facing lashes because they look pretty good. I just, for some reason, I feel like lazy and being a master actor, they just don't go together. Is that just me? I don't know. But he had like long surfer hair as a kid. But I guess we can just give him whatever now. I don't know. I guess we could just randomize and see what we get. See what looks good. I kind of like the idea of keeping the hair long. Should we do this one? I kind of love it. And I think when he was a kid, his hair was more like on the red brown side. So maybe more like, definitely more like that one. Okay. <laughs> I love him. I do. He's so, so, so cute, you guys. Very, very handsome boy. Um, he's gonna definitely pull all the ladies. That's for sure. All right, let's find him something to wear now. I don't even know how to dress him, but he definitely has Charlie's body type, which I think is pretty cool. I'm gonna give him just a bit of body hair, just a smidge. Yeah, maybe just like a little happy trail for now. A lazy goofball who wants to be an actor. An actor. <laughs> um... Well, I mean, Charlie was lazy and I just dressed him in like typical male clothing. I don't know what to do for this dude. I mean, we can still go for like that surfer look because like, I feel like that's kind of a lazy, more laid back type of style. This is gonna be so hard. Oh my gosh, I can already tell. Oh wait, look at this. I love this shirt because it has like that tucked in necklace. I really like that look. And what's his color gonna be? Should we do green for him? Ooh. Or like a maroon. <gasps> I think that looks really good. Oh my gosh. Okay. I love this already. Oh man, with boots. I mean, you guys, come on. That looks so good. Holy crap. Okay, this is a lot easier than I thought it was gonna be. <laughs> oh, but I love this type of style. Do you guys know what I mean? He reminds me of like a, is it Jason Momoa? Like that type? Okay, let's go with this then. I really like this look. One of you guys sent me this like copy and paste thing with MC Command Center where I can copy and paste stuff from every outfit onto the rest. I just haven't, 
I haven't looked into it yet, but I definitely will because um, that's like so clutch. It's something that I've always wished for in Cass. <laughs> so I'm gonna look into that soon. You guys are gonna have to let me know in the comments who your favorite kid has been so far. Uh, like from, from Stella and Charlie. I'm curious. All right, y'all. Here is his formal wear. Here is his athletic. Here's his sleep, his party, his swim, his hot weather, and his cold weather. I will uh, definitely spend more time with him in cast off camera, but I just needed to quickly put things on him for now. I hope you guys like him. Uh, so I guess we should get to work on his acting skill. Maybe he got uh, maybe he got inspired by Ren. We'll just we'll we'll go with that. <laughs> okay, so the family is here. Oh, ooh, shoot! Actually, crap. Hmm. Should we join Ren? I think we should just send her because I can't join her every single time she goes to work, unfortunately. But um, she should be able to do good on her own. Hopefully, fingers crossed. It's so weird that Ren is going to work. Who would have thought? All right, well, let's go ahead and get Charlie to take a photo of Bruce then. Aww. Happy birthday, sweet boy. Look at him, you guys. He's so, so, so cute. Maybe like we're like taking headshots so that he can like turn them into ad agencies, not ad agencies, acting agencies. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Hey, babe, are you busy? I miss you. I want to see you. Can you come over right now at 10 p.m.? A lot of you guys in the comments said that you think Paul is just like wanting Zoe for um, for woohoos. And I kind of get that feeling, too. I just I don't know. I don't know. I'm very confused about the whole thing. I don't know what to do with Zoe. I think we're just going to focus on her schooling and her job for now. And we'll focus on the love life later. I feel like we don't do that enough in this. So we gonna do that. Uh, so we need to do homework for robots of robots of land, sea, and blah, blah, blah. Okay, let's just do that really quick. And then the next homework that we need to do is up and atoms. Okay, no problem. Oh my gosh, all of these sims have the people, person, lifestyle. I forgot to check that out, so let's have a look. So Stella has energetic, um, various benefits when performing high energy activities, perform, per, prefers to perform high energy activities, increased work performance in high energy careers, decreased work performance in low energy careers. Crap, I think she has a low energy career. Yikes. Okay. And people person keeps lower relationship level friends easier, but struggles to keep good friends or higher. Uh, less likely to gain long-term sentiments, greater need to be social, tense when friend group contains fewer than four friend, fewer than four sims. All right then. <laughs> what trimester are you in, my love? Third trimester in 11 hours. Okay. All right. Well, I think we should go ahead and end the club gathering for the family. And start the household. Oh, the household is still going. Holy crap, look at how many points we have. Okay, let's spend some. Um, what would be good for us? Is there an acting bonus, perhaps? Okay, let's get that acting boost. Let's get... Is there a flower arranging boost? Yes, there is. Flower arranging boost. Let's grab the stronger camaraderie. Uh, this will boost that base happy buff you receive for being in a club gathering. And okay, I think that's good for now. Let's see how Ren's work performance is doing. It's going up, I think. Crap. <laughs> I don't even know. I don't know. We might have to like go with her. <sighs> that's rough. Okay, well, Stella, what do you need to do for your job? Gardening level six and flower arranging skill level two. So we need to go ahead and buy you one of those flower arranging tables. Oh, we already have one. Let's go. What can we do for magic? Oh, light on fire. Yeah, let's not do that. Okay, Stella. Well, come on over here. Teleport. Can you super sell yet? You cannot. Okay, no problem, no problem. Let's just harvest the death flowers for now and then um, let's make an arrangement. Let's make a daisy one. Daisies and bluebells. Oh girl, holy cow. She is so cool. Seriously, one of the coolest sims. Look at her, look at little pregnant bean making flower arrangements. Oh, she's having a crisis though, but it's okay. Oh. Yeah. 
Oh my gosh, what a cutie. What a cutie. She is creative, right? Did I just like make that up? Gosh, I hope not. Creative, clumsy, and loves outdoors. Okay, yes. Why is she business savvy? Business savvy Sims earn more than standard rate from their career. Okay, got it, got it, got it. Oh my gosh, wait, does Leslie have school tomorrow? She does. Okay, Charlie, you have to make her a sack lunch. You should make one for Bruce too. Let's see, make sack lunch. Uh, let's do veggie and hummus. I always forget that you can do this and it gives the kids like this really cute moodlet while they're at school. And Charlie just seems like the type. He doesn't do anything else. Oh no, did you get bit or did you get stung by the bees? What's this from? Activity withdrawal from energetic lifestyle. Stella hasn't been doing enough lately. <sighs> okay, uh, can you can you do yoga while you're pregnant? Or you can't. Okay, what about swimming laps? Okay, let's just swim some laps then. Oh, how cute! Yes! Little sack lunchy, love to see it. Okay, let's make another because you have more than one child. Let's do a tuna salad. <gasps> oh my gosh, Ren is officially a notable newcomer. Holy cannoli, she's gonna be famous. She's gonna be a five-star celebrity very soon. Nice, and we have two fame points to spend. Okay, so upload videos. No, definitely don't want that. Let's get networking and let's get noticeable. Bam, okay. And then let's go ahead and find another gig for her. This one right here pays the most and we need fitness level five, which we have, so no problem, no problem. Oh, her first flower arrangement, so gorgeous. Can we copy paste it? We can! Okay, come over here and do that so we can sell it, <laughs> sell two of them. Or keep one and sell two, I don't even know. I don't know what we should do. Let's go ahead and have a potion of plentiful needs. Oh my gosh, we have a magic talent point. Okay, let's, um. right, we were working on this branch. Okay, dope. Now we need to work on this one, and then we just need these three, and she will have the entire tree maxed out. How crazy is that? All right, let's, um, let's sell this one, sell this one, we'll just sell both. It's Harvest Fest today, so they, the kids don't have school. Dang it, we made those sack lunches for nothing. <laughs> Guess we could just put them in the fridge, save them for another time. Good morning, Zoe. Do you have class today? It says you have it in seven hours, but I don't even know if you do. You still need to do your homework for Up and Adams. Oh my gosh, come on, girl. I told you to do that so long ago. I know that we're not really focusing on Zoe right now, but there isn't really a lot that we can do besides do homework and study. <laughs> so things are a little dull at the moment. She has a lot of satisfaction points too, which is good. Okay, Stella made it to flower arranging number two. That's all that she needed. And uh, after that, I think I'm gonna get her to practice her gardening a bit. Maybe she can harvest these apples. It looks like Ren can mentor Bruce with his acting. I've never seen a Sim do this before. So I'm gonna see, let's see what that looks like. I told her to do it, but she canceled it out for some reason. Come over here. Wait, 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 Charlie got a lifestyle. People person, okay. Let's see what's in progress. Outdoorsy? Okay, Charlie, you go. Zoe's off to class, so make sure to take those notes. There she goes, she's mentoring him. Yes, and look, Rosie's here. Oh, look at you. Where's your baby at, Rosie Knox? What do you mean she wasn't as prepared? Was she late? Oh my gosh, that's so annoying. Ugh, how infuriating. There's just so much going on. I don't even... Where's that grand meal, Charlie? Did you not do it or did you leave it in the oven? Ugh! He probably made it and then set it down somewhere weird that I'm gonna find it later. <laughs> Bruce is feeling fearless. Nice. Keep practicing that acting, though. Kieran just asked Bruce if he wanted to get closer as friends. I think they would be so cute, like, friends. Don't you guys think? Let's go ahead and invite him over. I wonder how many club gatherings you can have going at once. Like, can two sims... Holy crap! Look at all the points we have again! <gasps> That's crazy. Okay, uh, so... I don't even know what to get. Herbalism boost? No, I want like a gardening boost. Where's the gardening one? Did we already buy that one? Oh, here it is. Let's grab that. Okay, let's also get a logic boost would be nice for Zoe. Okay, let's snag that. 
focus club vibe okay sure why not why not why not bruce is now acting level three good boy very good boy okay charlie why don't we go ahead and start a family gathering you have such a tiny pregnant belly it's actually not that big but what you're in question mark question mark question mark so she could be giving birth at any second it looks like she's helping leslie with her homework autonomously that's so freaking cute hello Kay. are you pregnant yet not quite very unfortunate <laughs> I have Zoe here studying for her, um, Kieran is sleeping, shoot, he's a vampire, I keep forgetting, we have to wait for a little bit, but let's, let's write, write our term paper, just get a head start on that. Oh boy, so much to keep track of. Hi Felix, happy Thanksgiving sir, Bruce is still here grinding on his acting skill, love to see it. I'm just gonna wait for Zoe to complete her paper, uh, and then we can eat. Oh shoot, Leslie's already digging in. I mean, fair enough. If you were hungry, that's fine. <gasps> Alice! Hello, queen! Oh my gosh. Ren, time to get up. Time to get up. Just come say hi to your daughter. I wonder... Hold on, let me check to see if she graduated yet. It looks like she's still... She's still in school. Okay. It's taking a while. I hope everyone sits at the dining table instead of just stands around. Please go sit. Uh, everyone's sitting in different spots. Who's this man? Ezra Starkey. Okay, we don't know you, sir. Please leave. So we've got Kyla, Luna, Zoe, and Charlie here at this table. Aww. Happy Thanksgiving. Aww. We got Caleb and Alice sitting alone. I wonder if their relationship is just like super awkward. We have a bunch of people outside for some reason. Uh, Bruce, Bruce, Leslie, and Stella. We've got Felix doing push-ups over here for some reason. Ren's just having herself a plasma pack. Fair enough, fair enough. <laughs> um, okay, Ren, why don't you um, come sit over here with Caleb? Why don't you um, enjoy company? Can you be thankful for your mom? You can. Adorable. I love this family so much. There's probably like a lot of people that were missing here, but I think this is pretty much everyone. It's, you know, who are missing? Lilith and her kids. Kyla's husband and her daughter. I don't know why she never- Oh look, Silas decides to show up. Hi, Silas. <laughs> It looks like Bruce needs a little bit of fun. I'm gonna give him a potion of plentiful needs because ain't nobody got time to take care of needs, you know? Here you go, Brucey. Drink that, and then I'm gonna get you to practice your acting some more. Zoe, who are you getting romantic with? Hook up in closet? With who? I need to keep a watchful eye because the only people here that are not family are, I guess Caleb's technically not family, and Silas. Bruh. Okay. Back to your computer you go. Holy cow, I cannot afford you getting pregnant right now with, with a family member. I just can't. Aww, she's off to cheer up her stuffed animal. Ren, why are you naked in here? Oh, you're just having a shower. All right, then. <laughs> so I really want her to max her mental skill. She's just almost there. She just needs to play a little bit of chess. So uh, yeah, looks like Felix is playing. Can we join game? Play together? Let's just do that. Poor Stella needs herself a potion of plentiful needs. There she goes. She maxed it. I love it. I'll absolutely love to see it. Seems like some people had an awful harvest fest. Some people had a good harvest fest. As long as we had a grand meal and everyone was here, I'm happy. All right, let's end that gathering. Looks like we have more club points as usual. What did I say that I wanted to get this time? Okay, let's get another strong, stronger camaraderie one. Let's just get that up there. Okay, so next up, oh wait, shoot, <gasps> no. Oh God, no, 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 no. Today is Charlie's birthday. Oh, okay, good. It's because it's 2.30. Okay, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. So tonight, we are gonna go out and uh, go out to a restaurant or like have like a bar night or something like that for his birthday. I think, I hope I remember to put the cake in the inventory so that we can age him up wherever we are. Or if we go to a restaurant, we can age him up at the restaurant. 
It looks like Zoe needs herself a potion of plentiful needs. So just get that going. And then how, what do we need to do for school? Did you finish your paper? Okay, you got class in eight hours and you've done your homework for that. What about, did you do your term paper? That's what you were doing. But like, I don't know if you finished it or not. Okay, let's just edit it. I'm really trying hard with her this term, you guys. Like, I am determined. Ren has her audition today, which she's probably gonna smash. No worries on that. He's almost leveling up in his acting, which is fantastic. But I don't think he- he didn't drink this potion of plentiful needs like I told him to. I think this is level 4 for him. Oh my gosh, level 5. Let's freaking go. So, for the rest of this episode, we are just going to celebrate Charlie's birthday, go out, age him up, and then I'm going to save the talent showcase and Leslie's birthday for the next episode. Time flies. I feel like I can do all these things in one episode and then like I'm just like two hours deep into filming and we've only gone through like two days. It's crazy. But yeah, I'm going to get Bruce to do his homework. Because he has school in four hours. Holy cow. Yeah, do your homework. We've been focusing on his acting so much. But he's already level five as a teen. So I'm pretty satisfied at the rate that that is going. I am going to get Leslie to clean up so that it ups her manners, I think it is. Stella, what do we need to do for you, Bean? Oh, Max is here and he's taking care of the garden. How cute. Okay, I'm going to get her to do another flower arrangement. Ooh, $145 for this daisy, daisy arrangement. Very nice. Oh, yeah, and I'm also just waiting for her to, like, give birth. <laughs> Hopefully that comes soon. Hopefully uh, before we go out, because I don't want her to, like, go into labor while we're out and about. Oh, what was that? Zoe's paper is looking good. At this point, further editing won't improve it much, though it may help Zoe grasp the material better. Okay, yeah, I think, uh, I think I'm good then. I'm going to get her to submit it. Look at Leslie in the background there. Submit term paper. Her presentation. Shoot, we need to be working on that as well. Oh my gosh, I totally forgot. All right, come over here. Capture some info. Thank goodness for those potions of plentiful needs, you guys. I don't know what we would do without them. Everything would be so much, much more difficult. Leslie has school. Bruce has school. Stella has work, which... Yeah, send her there. Ren has her audition today. Oh my gosh, yes, yes, Stella's in labor. Holy cannoli crap, she's at work though. We have to wait until she gets back. Wait, is she back? Oh wait, no, she's back. Oh, you can't be in labor at work? Okay, fair enough. Are you gonna... Okay, well, let's just send her. All right, let's go to the hospital, I mean. I'm so excited. I am so, so, so excited. Bask in the light rays? Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Go nature walking? Okay, have baby at the hospital. Join. Definitely gonna join her. Definitely gonna be bringing along Charlie, of course. Fingers crossed for twins. Fingers crossed. So now, we're gonna have a bunch of sims to take care of and some babies. Or a baby, I'm not sure yet, but this generation is so freaking hectic. I cannot wait for a generation where there's just like one or two sims to take care of. I don't think that it, that's ever gonna happen though, but unless everyone dies in a fire or something. Fingers, or I mean, not, not fingers crossed, no. Wait, Ren. Oh my God, are you serious right now? You didn't even go, did you? Holy cannoli. Okay, I'm very upset. Charlie is dancing in the lobby. This is how he deals with stress. Um, oh crap, she's over here already giving birth. Jeez, girl. It says that she's still at work for some reason, which is kind of annoying because I can't control her. She's just waiting for a doctor. We got a ghost doctor. Love it. I actually think this was one of Olive's friends. Oh my gosh, it's a girl. Love to see it, you guys. Love it, love it, love it. I'm gonna name her Marnie. It's from the show Girls, if you guys have ever seen it. I just think this uh, name is really, really cute. Marnie Campos, okay. Just one girl, just one girl. You're kidding me. We didn't have twins. That is not big mood. Crap, dude, we didn't have twins. She has the fertile trait and everything. What the heck? No, Charlie, no dancing. Go home, sir. Oh my gosh, you guys, crap, we didn't have twins. All right. 
That's a bunch of hoopla, y'all. Hoopla. Oh, there are the gnomes. Okay, where did they stick the baby? Oh, there she is in Leslie's room. And it looks like we got a spellcaster babe. That's very exciting. I'm just gonna stick her right here though, like right when you walk in because I want everyone to be able to take care of her. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. One baby, just one. Why don't you come over here and rock her? Charlie, I'm gonna need you to come over here and take a photo. Aww. Look at little Stella babes. Oh my gosh. So cute. I guess we're gonna have to get them to try for baby again right now before Charlie ages up. So try for baby with Stella. I'm so glad I remembered. I'm pissed at Ren. Why didn't you go to your audition? What's the problem? All right, Stella. Let's go over here, take a pregnancy test, see if you're pregnant. She's still in her hospital gown. <laughs> okay, Stella, my fertile bean. I know you have it in you. Let's see it. Let's see it. Yes, girl. Oh, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Love it. 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 Okay. Bruce, you are looking real rough. Just an absolutely horrible shape. So I'm gonna get you one of these potions. Go ahead and drink that. Drink it. Oh, right, tonight we need to go out for Charlie's birthday. So let me just make sure everyone is in a good mood. We haven't seen Zoe do any magic in a while. She's been focusing so hard on her uni. I'm so proud. Oh, 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 right. Don't let me forget the cake. I'm, f I'm remembering it. What am I saying? <laughs> Don't let me forget the cake when I just remembered. Okay, uh, this one has candles on it. Yes, it does. Fantastic. Let's go ahead and put this in Charlie's inventory and let's let's travel. It's crazy. I'm looking at the names of everyone in this Let's Play and everyone's name is either... No, it's they're like all two syllables. They're very short names. Mine's the only one that's three, Savannah. Oh, Oliver. 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 Shoot, I don't know. <gasps> Uh, okay, that's fine. No worries. All right, here we are. It looks like everyone is in their nice outfit except for Alice for some reason, but let me just uh, fix that. Okay, yeah, everyone's looking really nice. Oh, I think this is where prom was. Yes, yes, yes. I love, love, love this lot. Zoe is thinking about homework. Honey, you don't have to think about homework right now. We are celebrating. It's the weekend. Just relax. All right, everyone is added to the group. Let's go inside, order drinks for group. Let's get, let's get some zebra fizzes. Zero dollars, holy cannoli, that, what a steal. Can I get a round for everyone in my group, please? Oh, there's Kay. Wait, what? <gasps> you guys, it's not just the CC, right? My eyes are not deceiving me. Oh. <gasps> Felix and Kay are having twin boys. Oh my gosh, I have never been so happy in my life. Holy cow. That, that's a lie, I definitely have, but twin boys, that's two grandkids. And what does Charlie need for his aspiration? Have four grandchildren. Okay, that, that, that that's freaking halfway. That's good enough for me. Oh, there's Paul, there's Kyla. Gaba, what are you hish? Yummy zebra fizzes. This is very classy. Everyone is just vibing, sitting, having a drink. I really do love to see it. Bruce, what's the matter? You're a teenager, you're out of the club. What's wrong? What's wrong with you? Stressed from having a mood swing. Okay, well, um, can you like talk it through maybe with Alice or you don't even know Alice. Okay, let's just introduce ourselves. Can you talk it through with Luna perhaps? Complain about problems. Oh, cute brother and sister oh, times. I am just so stressed out. I have been working myself to the bone with this acting stuff. And I don't know. I don't know how, how did you do it? How did you become such a professional writer at such a young age? She's like, well, it's what I wanted. And I just put my mind to it. That's it. Oh, he's crying. She's like, why are you crying? And just vent to her, vent to her, vent to her. Felix is having a good old boogie. Looks like Paul is here. What are you drinking, sir? Oh, Rosie's here in her athletic wear. Okay. For some reason, I can't see their pictures at the moment, but it's fine. 
Dance with Charlie. Yes. Oh my gosh. I love this sim. Zoe, dance with Paul. Oh, Leslie. Uh, crap, I can't tell her to build her skills for some reason. That's annoying. I do want Bruce to get to know Kieran some more. I want them to be like best friends. You know what? It's been wonderful to spend time with you. We've made some great memories and we'll make many more. I'm sure of it. Bruce and Luna just had that sentiment. How cute is that? Oh my gosh, we can become best friends forever. Let's do that. Oh wait, this song is definitely gonna get me copyrighted. <laughs> um, Crap, I can't change. I can't, oh my gosh, I can't change the song. Shoot, I might have to put other music over this because I can't change it. Kay is here just eating chips because she can't drink because she's pregnant. <gasps> Twins! Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay, I'm gonna get... Let's see, Charlie, where's that cake at? Let's bust this out. Let's get you to make a wish. Age you up before it becomes two o'clock and we run out of time. Happy birthday, sir! It's your birthday, Charlie! Love you so much! You're gonna be an elder now! I can't believe it! I can't believe it! Aww! Look at everyone! So sweet! Okay, Charlie! Oh, man! Oh, yeah! Sage up with them back problems! I'm so sad. This was actually very successful. I feel like we rented out the whole space for this. Oh, honey, Felix, what happened? <laughs> yeah, I feel like this is like a very private party, but oh, look who's here. Kiyoshi, your guys' favorite sim ever. What? How old is he? He's a young adult. Maybe we should get Zoe to introduce herself. Let's just do a polite introduction. I think I don't we haven't had kids with any NPCs in this series, so that would be kind of interesting to do, would it not? But let's see how well they get along. Let's see if she introduces herself, how far that relationship bar goes up. Hi, I'm Zoe. I saw you on the dance floor. It went up almost halfway. So um, let's just share ideas with him. I don't know if he's I don't know. Is he married? But um, let's go ahead and call Tamil. Everyone take a piece together and just enjoy your night. He just walked away from us as we were telling him a story. Well, that's rude. Leslie is angry. I don't know why. Unwanted sibling. Oh my gosh. Well, we can just say that she's angry because everyone went out without her. She's home at a, with the babysitter and Marnie. She's probably not not vibing that very much. Can we ask him like how he feels about our relationship? Oh, ask about relationship. OK, let's do that. I'm really nervous to see what he's going to say. Things aren't really. Oh, my gosh. <gasps> he said things aren't really moving forward for me emotionally with you. So it is purely. It's purely physical. OK, well, OK, that that answers it. Paul is officially out of the question, out of the picture. I know that you guys love him, especially you guys in the discord. But yikes, they have such a fantastic relationship, according to these bars. But he just said that he doesn't feel that it's moving forward. Sorry, guys, it is what it is. The Sims have spoken. This is Kyla's husband, by the way. Um, yeah, cute times. I seriously cannot wait for her to have her baby. Who's this? Oh, this is Kaden's wife. Kieran's husband, or Kieran's, Kieran's dad's wife. She's thinking about Ren. Oh my gosh, how awkward. She's probably like, there's that biatch that took my husband that had, oh my gosh, that's, that's so funny. I live for this kind of stuff. You guys you don't understand. I live for it. Look at Luna. She's so cute. So curious. Just always off on her own doing her own thing. I love it. All right, then. Well, I say we end this little shindig. That was pretty successful. I love how everyone just like hung out at the bar, ate a bit, danced, just spent time together. It was really nice. I'm so I cannot say this enough. I'm so excited for Felix and Kay's twins. It's about time. Alrighty. So I am going to leave this episode right here. In the next one, we are going to give Charlie a little bit of an elder makeover. 
We are going to have another baby with Stella. We are going to try and uh, get get some good grades. I think we're gonna get her grades in the next one. This presentation looks really nice. Um, I guess we can just practice presenting for a little while. For Ren, hopefully we will have another acting gig. And then for Bruce, we're just gonna continue working on his acting skill and hopefully make him some friends in the next one too. And then age up Marnie, age up Leslie. Let's check the calendar. So that's the first thing we're gonna do in the next episode is age up Leslie and see what her life's gonna be about. And then that night, we're gonna go to the talent showcase so Charlie can um, perform his comedy routines that he's been working so hard on. And then after that, we're gonna age up Marnie, give her her makeover. Uh, ooh, the Starlight Accolades. Hmm, should we attend again and see if there's any mystery rewards to be given? <laughs> and then it looks like we got Winterfest Eve and Winterfest and then Stella's birthday. No, that's Zoe. Oh, holy cannoli. Okay. Whoo. Okay. Also, you guys are gonna have to let me know how you feel about giving Stella like a completely new look with her hair at least, or if we should give Zoe a new look with her hair because a lot of you guys have trouble like telling them apart. So let me know what you think. Let me know. I am still so very in love with this Let's Play. It's just, I just love it. <laughs> I hope you guys like Bruce's makeover. Let me know what you think in the comments about everything. And I will see you in my next video, which is going to be not so berry, which I'm super stoked about as well. I love you guys. And I hope you have a great Sunday or a great whatever day of the week this is that you're watching. <laughs> All right. I love you. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.